minutes till the opening bell rings here on Wall Street. Time for Kramer's Mad Dash ahead of the open. It's Ireland Day here at the yes, New York Stock is. Exchange. So, broth, Shabin, and of course, yes, uh, the Banshee. All right, go. Ahead. All right. <laughs> but you were taking a look at some Irish trades, yes, Bank of Ireland I'm, for one. If you do think that Ireland's going to come back, the IRE did not get the big bailout. Uh, that is the uh, Bank of Ireland. I happen to think it's somewhat attractive because I believe the Irish economy is going to come back. I know that's heresy. Most people do not think that Ireland is anything other than just going to tip back down into a severe recession. I disagree. Not that many people there. Very thrifty. Very. Uh, I can, I'm going there in May. I've been there many, Are many times. Really? This is a population, the highest educated population in Europe, sure. and people keep counting them out, and I think it's a big mistake. A robust tech sector. Yes. Uh, lots of tech companies I visited, operating in I Ireland. I visited as the well. Intel plant in Dublin. Mm -hmm. I went to the beautiful EMC plant. This country may be, and this would be the play, other than CRH, an aggregate company, but that's largely in the United States. Yeah. I do think that Ireland should not be written off. It would be a big mistake. Yeah, we got it down 3% along with a lot of the European banks as well as miners. Uh, meantime, I want to go head over to uh, Brian Sullivan at the podium. All right, Melissa and Jim, thank you very much. That's right, the opening bell is just a few minutes away, and Ireland's Prime Minister, Enda Kelly, is going to ring that bell. So, lads and lasses, get ready. It is on another big day of trading. It is Apple all day today, along with Ireland, my bad Irish accent, and more coming up right after this.